I've been waiting so long for these PSA grades to come in. Um, they popped, and I didn't look at any of them, which is nuts, because I wanted to do this video um, and to see what we got. So we got 52 cards graded. I got a, a killer deal on it. That's the only reason why you're probably going to see some of these cards. Like, why would you get that graded? Um, but there's some killer, killer cards in here. Like, so if you're an NBA fan, uh, if you're a UFC fan, and if you're an NFL fan, stick around. Let's see what we got. Let's hope we didn't bomb out on some grades, man. But we got 52 fire cards coming up. Let's see what we grade back at. Yeah. So first one, let's... um. I want to... See, because there's so many cards graded here, I want to just kind of, I don't know if I want to start with, um, fire first. Let's start with the other one first. Start with this bad boy first, man. This, this weighs a ton. Uh, so nervous, y'all. Oh my gosh, look at that. Just racks on racks on racks, baby. Okay, so hopefully they did them in the way that I submitted them because I submitted like the, the less valued cards kind of first. So let me just quickly take this away, all right, and just make sure that I'm not going to check any grades. I just want to see... Kind of if they graded them in the way that I submitted them. They didn't. They didn't. So we're just going to go through them. We're just going to go through them. There will be fire cards here. Um, and there will be some non-fires, some non -fires, right? So, okay. We'll, we'll start with this end. Okay. So here we go. All right. So the first one was a SGA rated rookie card um, that I had graded. Let's see what we got on that one. We got an eight. Okay. That's okay. That's okay. I don't want to see anything below an eight, though. I don't want to see anything below an eight. And by the way, there's way better cards here than 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 a uh, than you know a rated rookie um, type thing. Okay, so the first one we got an eight on. Okay, next one. See what we got. We got UFC. Okay, so we got um, Tetsuro here. Now I believe this is. I want to say it's his gold. I had a few of these graded. Anyway, let's go. Okay, this is his rated rookie. This is his hollow, um, and that's an eight as well. Okay, that's an eight. Hmm. Not starting out the best. We're not starting out the best here, y'all. Okay, two eights. Come on, PSA, don't do us dirty like this. All right, Bo Nickel. Anybody who knows UFC knows who Bo Nickel is. Um, that's a 10. Yeah, baby. Rated rookie, Bo Nickel, 10, Jim Man. Okay, good. It's getting worried. It's getting worried that I got that that grader with beef. Who's <laughs> like he's having a bad day, and it's like, uh, yeah, let's just not grade this dude. Good, very well. Okay, so we got our first ten. Good. Okay, let's keep going. All right, UFC, UFC on the horizon. Now this is kind of like. I want to say it's the downtown, downtown kind of ripoff, but they still sell really, really well because they're extremely limited. Um, and a bow nickel, obviously, we want to see a good grade here. Like eight or below, I'm just going to be pissed. A ten, yeah, boy. All right, bow nickel on the horizon. Ten. Okay, feeling good. I'm feeling good. I'm feeling good. That one smacks. 
that one smacks. Okay, good. Keep going. All right. Told you if you're a UFC fan, you're gonna like some of these pulls. Molly McCann, Meatball. This was a slash 30, I believe. Um, the 30th anniversary edition. She just won a big fight. Um, and that comes back at a nine. Okay, so that's out of 30. Um, Holler, 30th anniversary, nine. That's okay. And then we'll take some meatball action there. Meatball on the nine. Like I said, I got a killer, killer deal on the, on the cost to grade these cards. Um, so like some of these cards, you know, you're going to be like, well, why did, why do you even grade it? But. All right. Okay. So Octagon Signatures. This is a this is a gold Bass Rutten, um, who is a absolute legend in the Octagon. This is two out of ten, and we got a ten. Look at that, baby. Hell yeah. Ten and the signature. It's not an on card sig. Um, it's a sticker sig, but still. Um, we'll take that. We'll take that. Old Dizzy Day. Okay. Let's keep going. All right. So this is another Atetsura. Now this was a gold uh, 3 out of 10 that we pulled. So very, very in-demand fighter. It's going to be one of the best, I think. Um, and that comes back at a 9, which is Flames. 9. I wanted a 10. Really, really wanted a 10 on this one. Um, but... You know, a nine's okay. A nine's okay. It, like I said, anything, anything nine, nine or ten's what we want. Obviously, ten. You know, everybody likes a ten, but nines are okay. Okay, NBAs. Let's get into some NBAs. This is Scooty Henderson. Um, so the NBA uh, Panini Hoops ran a presentation series where they did twenty basketball players. Um, anywhere from the KDs to the Kevin Durant's, I'm sorry, Kevin Durant's to the Wimbin Um, I've already, I've got the whole set of these, right? So I graded the last 10 of them. My Wimby came back at a nine. Um, so I'll be interested to kind of see what these, these get, but Scoot's balling out, man. Like this is a, okay, that's a nine. That's good. I'll take a nine. Scooty is balling out and I love this presentation, um, super short print that the NBA hoops did in the in the hobby boxes. Um, I like them so much I got the whole set, and I had to pull a lot of them through eBay. Obviously, hey, it is what it is. I love the manga kind of like style colorway. Okay, sure, Thompson. Um, I'm very unfortunate injury. He's out for the rest of the season. I don't think. This card's really going to hold the same weight as his brother Amen is. I mean, that comes back as a 10. That's dope. Okay. 10. 10 on there, Shaw Thompson. And there are some not so good rookies on these presentation cards, like Derek Whitehead, for example. Okay, Brandon Miller. Okay. Pick number three. University of Alabama, shout out. I want a good grade on this one. 10. Yes. Yeah, boy. That's good. I like that. I like that. Especially because I want to say I bought that one on eBay for like, I don't know, definitely not, not a lot of money. Okay, Chris Murray, who's playing pretty good on Portland. We got a nine on Chris. Nine on Chris. I'm sorry if you don't like this presentation um, variety. Because <laughs> you're going to see 10 of them, unfortunately. Uh, but Chris Murray, we got a nine on. Okay. KD. 10, baby. Okay. Let's go. KD. The 10 on the KD. I like it. I like it a lot. Okay. We're grading well so far. Had nothing below an eight. And the eights that we got on, I wasn't super mad about. Trey Young, nine. There we go. Okay. So 
So far, we're doing pretty good on our upgrades. I'm happy. Happy. Nines and tens all day, baby. Okay, Luca. Luca presentations. I want this to be a ten so bad. Ten! What's up? Okay, the Luca presentations with the ten, baby. Love that. Love that. Okay, Giannis. Oh, that's a nine. Okay, tasty. Some for a for a brief second there, I thought that was a six. Giannis, what's that? Don't you love the design of those though? I just think they're so dope. I love the illustrative designs on them. Okay, Jalen Hood Shafino. Again, like there's some good rookies and there's some okay ones and and who knows. That's a nine too. And then I promise we're probably done with these presentations. So. <laughs> I just wanted to get them all graded because I love the set. I, I like to I, I wanted to collect all of them. Okay, case and wallet. Now this is a good rock. Nine. Nine. I was hoping we could get a ten on him. Nine's okay though. Nine is okay. Nine is okay. Okay. Okay, we got two more presentations, y'all, and then we'll get back to UFC and some NFL. Derek Whitehead, like I said, uh, nine. You know, it's definitely the worst card in the presentation set. This big, this one next coming up though, this is going to be big for me because I'm a big believer in this guy. Um, who is now the starting point guard on the Jazz, logging 32 minutes, Keontae George, who in my opinion, like if it wasn't for Wemby, um, I think Chet Holmgren might have been with it as well. I think he would be in Rookie of the Year discussion, maybe. Ten! Boom. Okay. Loving it. Loving it. Keontae George, 10, baby. Let's go. That's the, that's it for the NBA hoops presentations, by the way. So if you weren't into that, we got through it. Okay, UFC. Let's get back to some UFC. Bo Nickel. Bo Nickel rookie card. This is a prism. This is a hyper prism. Um, boom, nine. Nine on the Bo Nickel hyper prism. Like it. Like that a lot. By the way, there's some fire UFC immaculate series that we got graded that if those come back good oh my gosh I'm gonna be screaming all right we got dust in the diamond this is a photon um super short print that came out um and that's a nine okay that's okay that was one of the like I said some of these I got like deal, deals on them where it's like, hey, if you throw in the X amount of cards, we'll reduce the price by this. So like some of the super rare short prints, um, I just threw in there. Um, but dust in the diamond at a nine. That's fun. Okay, Aaron, my girl. My girl, Aaron Blanchfield. This is a 39. So this is a black velocity card. Um she's gonna be huge. I've got so many good cards of her. I've got a slash three of three memorabilia booklet hand signed with the UFC her trunk fight one patch on it. That's fire. We got a nine. Ah, okay. I was really hoping for a ten on her. That's okay. Rated rook. Nine. We'll take it. Again. We've had nothing below an eight. We've only had two eights. This is where the Immaculate are going to screw us. I know it. The old, the, like the super high value ones. I, I, no, I'm not even going to, I'm not going to talk it into existence. Okay. A Tatsuro again. You can tell I'm a big fan of this dude. This is a bookend, by the way, 39 out of 39. So this is a black velocity. Gem 10, baby. Let's go. Love it. Love it, love it, love it, love it. Oh yeah, baby. Rated rookie. Love that. Okay. Oh, I lied to y'all. 
I lied to you. We got two more presentations. <laughs> and then we got some Wendy's. Then we got some real Wendy's that will crack and see what we got. So we got JT, Jason Tatum. I'm a Celtics fan. Ah, there's there's another eight. Okay. That's a shame. That's a shame. But okay. Okay. We had to get an eight. We had to get another eight sometime. And then this is this is the last presentation one. This is Steffi. A 10 on this would be dark. 10. Yes. Dude, we are lucking out on these grades, man. We are lucking out on these grades, bro. I'm stoked. Okay. Next one up. This is a Victor Wimby. This is a Wimby Nyama. So this is a Panini Donruss. Super short print, press proof, hardwood classic, I think, purple variety. So fairly rare, um, fairly rare, 10. Yeah, baby, hardwood masters, press proof purple. That's a 10 on the Wemby. Not sure, I don't know what that's gonna, what the price of those ones are, right? Obviously it's, uh, it's Donruss, so it's not the um, prism. Uh, but, you know, we'll see. By the way, I have the Webinyama Snakeskin Prism. Um, that just sold on eBay for... The gem that just sold on eBay yesterday. I was tracking it for $13,600. That's being graded right now. I'm going to do a, just a one-off video on that. And if I get a, if I get a 7 on that, I'm going to cry on camera. Oh, God, I keep lying to you guys. I'm sorry. There's one more presentation here. It's a Jimmy Buckets, and it's an eight. Told y'all I got the whole set. I told y'all. I told y'all. All my other ones um, were all tens, except for Wimba Nyama, which I did not pull. I bought off eBay. Um, it was a nine, but, you know, I just, it, it was a killer price, and uh, I just... With the market so hot on them right now, I just you know, I pulled the trigger on it because it's slow. Okay, this is another Wimby. Now, this is a insert on the Prism Basketball Series. So, this is a Prism Silver, and this is a deep space. Um, so, there's the regular, there's the silver, and then there's the green variety. And maybe there's a purple, too. I think this is just a, this is just a regular silver Prism, though. Um, boom, baby. Oh my God, a 10. I love that. Space Silver. Look how beautiful that card is, man. Look how beautiful that card is. That's sick. I'll take any 10 Wemby all day. So far, both our Wembys have been 10s. All right. Okay, we got another Wemby Nyama here. Now, this Wemby is. I think I submitted three. This is Cracked Ice. This is the Cracked Ice Limited Super Short Print. Um, if we get a good grade on this one, we're paid. Ten. Look how sexy that is, bro. A ten on the Wimby Ice, baby. Ten on the Wimby Ice. Oh, my God. If I get a 10 on my snakeskin Wimby, dude, that's sick. Dude, that's sick. The three Wimbies all came back as 10s. Especially this one. I don't know. I got to do a price comp on that. I'm sure that's, that's a couple of hundred bucks. Um, okay. Amen Thompson. So this was a next day autograph. And so what they are, are... Um, the cards will be printed and then they'll hand them out to the player and the player will physically sign the card, right? So the players touch the card, they've signed it on. Um, I have a Scoot Henderson version of this, by the way, and he doesn't sign autographs with Panini. So it says this and then just no autograph in big block letters, which completely devalues the card. So this would be dope to get a good grade on this. Now, remember, this is hand signed and it's hard to get really good hand side grades. 
So anything like an eight or above on this, I'd be happy with. A nine. There we go. That's 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 done. That's done. That's the Amen Thompson next day autograph nine. I'm happy about that. Because like I said, the the you don't know how the, the 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 players feeling that day. Maybe they've just got out of practice. You know, they have a whole bunch of cards dumped in front of them and they just start signing. But that's a pretty clean autograph. I knew it was somewhat clean. That's why I had it submitted. Uh, but that's a good one. Okay. Told you we've got some NBA fire. Okay. Now we'll get into some NFL. So this is a, this is a funny one because this is the, the only... I ripped so many Prism NFL hobby boxes. This was the only one of one... Um, I got and it was Trey Lance in his non rookie year, right? When he after he went to the Cowboys, uh, free Trey Lance, please. Somebody take him and make him good. Um, but this is a one of one, so the chances of getting you know this is a black finite one on one. The chance the chances of getting this are, you know, nine. Okay, well that that blows. I mean the card blows anyway. Let's be honest, but. The finite one of ones. I mean, I just got it graded just to grade it. A nine. Okay, that's all right. So the hope there on Trey is somebody signed them. He gets his starting position back and he starts balling out. It ain't going to be with the Cowboys, right? So this card probably isn't really going to hold a lot of value, even though it's a one on one. Because whatever, whatever team, unless they really believe in him and he's, he's Dak's replacement. Um, I don't think that card's going to hold a lot of value, all the time. even 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 at a one on one. Okay, now we get into now these are a little bit more common, guys. Um, so this is a this is a B. John Robinson uh, rookie card disco prism that came back as a nine. That's okay. Nothing super special about that. That's not even numbered. That's just a disco. Prism colorway. So, so, like I said, some of these cards I just got super. Okay, Jamar Gibbs. I I did a few of him, so I'm not sure what this one is. I did a. There's a sticker order. There's a purple, and then I did an absolute one. Um, okay, so this is his pul uh, purple pulsar, and that came back as a ten rookie card. So that stuff. I think Jamar's gonna be good. It's a good good rookie to collect. Lions have a stacked um, 2023 rookie card. You got Laporta, you got Gibbs, Hooker. Who am I missing? I'm sure I'm missing one, but uh, a 10 on that stuff. That's good. Okay. Um, speaking of Lions, Laporta, Sam Laporta. This one's an auto uh, silver. And that came back at a 9. Okay, so we are, we're doing pretty good on the grades. We're doing pretty good on the grade field. I thought this, uh, you know, this video could have been a disaster. I could have been getting six and sevens and stuff. But, I mean, obviously I know a little bit what I'm doing before I send the card in for grading. Like, I want to make sure it's somewhat centered and not, and that corners aren't all jacked up. Right? Um, but, you know, a nine there is pretty good. Okay, this is a cool one. This is Will Levis, who hopefully is the future of the Titans, um, QB. Um, and this, I think this is a purple or a pink. Um, so it's through 125, rookie, prism. And yes, purple Will Levis, rookie card to 10. Love it. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. That's sick. Let's just hope he, he pans out. Let's just hope he pans out. Okay, it's another B. John uh, Robinson. Um, this is a insert um, fireworks, I want to say. Um, and this is 249. And that's a gem 10. Fireworks purple power by the 49 on the B. John. Sick. Sicky, sicky, sicky. We're lucking out on the NFL grades, y'all. 
And then this is a B. John. The game. This is one I got a killer deal to grade on. Um, this is just a. This is his rookie card. But I think it's like the throwback rookie or whatever variant they have. This is rookie card number, flashback rookie. Um, and that comes back as a 10 too. So that's a sexy card. I like it. I like the shimmer of it. That's about 10. 10 on Robinsons. We'll take them. Like I said, it's not low numbered, right? Like, I mean, there's no number on it at all. It's probably super, super good. Cool. That's not a rare card. Let's just be honest with ourselves. Okay. Back into some UFC. Okay, Brandon, uh, the baby face assassin Moreno. This is my house. This is from the um, 2023, the Donruss Optic series. Um, so this is an insert. The only reason I got this graded is it's a bookend. It's five of five. So this is a green and that comes back as a gem 10, which is dope. So only five of those were made. Brandon Moreno sells really well. Plus, he's a great dude. Great fighter. Just had a really good win, too. Okay, cool. Like it. I'm liking it. All right. Speaking of great fighters here, Paul Rosses, Rising Suns. This is a one of 10. One of 10. Oh, it's a nine. Ah, oh, I was hoping that would be a 10. Ah. Oh. But that's a sexy card, am I right? I'll take the nine. Plus it's one of ten bookend. Okay. I think that one's gonna have some value to it. Especially if he blows up. Uh okay, let's see. Who else we got? You can see I'm a Tatsuro fan, man. Tatsuro. I got two of these. These are white sparkle. These are super, super short prints. Um, these are worth money if they grade well. Ten. Fuck. I mean, fudge yeah. Fudge yeah, man. Rising Sun, White Sparko, Tetsura. Ten. Boom. This is the same card, by the way. White Sparkle. Not ten. <laughs> Yeah, boy, let's do it. Let's do it. Yeah, these are uh, these ones are worth a little bit because they're very, very rare to get the white spot. All right, bow nickel. This is a white sparkle as well. Oh no, that's an eight. Oh, I was hoping that would be a ten. Dang it. See, now some of these cards, I mean, depending on the value, right? These are like hundreds, hundred dollars, whatever, right? But for example, like the, the snakeskin Wemby that I'm having graded, if it gets a nine versus a 10, you're talking thousands of dollars. Not these cards, right? But but still. Um, so this will, this is my, this is my last non-immaculate bow nickel. This was a Dominator's White Sparkle. Oh man, that's an eight too. What? I thought that card looked clean AF. Okay, an eight. Damn it. We missed on the bows, man. We missed on the bows. An eight. Shit. Okay. All right. What do we got now? We got NFL, 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 and UFCs. Okay, so let's, I'm sorry. We got an NFL and then three UFCs, and then we've got like five left. And then, and then we'll be done. Thanks for hanging out with me, man. This is fun. I've been waiting for this one for a long time. Okay, so this is from the Panini Absolute Football Series. Um, this is a CMC. And this is um, a sh one through five. There are only five of these cards. And we got a nine on it. Two of five. It's not his rookie card. Um... But that's dope. We'll take a nine. We'll take a CMC sell as well. Especially uh, super short print like that. Two out of five. That ain't bad. Just fits the sleeve too, baby. Just fits the sleeve. CMC two of five, grade nine. Okay. 
All right, now we got immaculate. We got three immaculates here. And these are, um, these are worth some money. So this is John Jones. This was his purple, meaning three. There's only three of these. This is one, number one of three. Immaculates, I don't know, man. I've, I've heard bad things about the grades, but a nine. Okay, we'll take that. We'll take the nine John Jones purple. That is a bad card. Yeah, anything below like an, a, a nine or an eight there, I'm gonna flip. Okay, John, Johnny Bones, greatest of all time. One out of three, that comes back at a nine. Okay, my girl Erin Blanchfield. I keep talking about her big fight this weekend. Um, this would be, if I remember correctly, this is a slash 99 patch on card autograph. 10! Yes! Look at that, man. That is, it's hard to get 10s. Harder, I should say, to get 10s when the athlete actually signs the card. Like I was talking about with this one, with the Amen. Um, and, you know, obviously, like, centering, corner grades, um, you know, edges, blah, blah, blah. But, but the autographs on the cards, it's hard to get a 10. So I am stoked about that one, man. Aaron coming back. It's a slash 99, right? So it's not super, super rare. But still, that's a great rookie card to have at a gem 10. Because, again, I think she's going to be really good. And then the last one for this box, this is another John Jones. This is a slash 10. This is one of those cool men patches. Um, this, I think, are his fight-worn gloves. And that comes back as a 10. That's sick, bro. That's sick. You know how hard it is to grade 10 on a card like that? That's sick, bro. John Jones memorabilia gloves. So that's the real gloves that he's used in a real fight. And that comes back as a 10. And this is so fat. I'm not sure if I'm even going to be able to bag it. I can. I can bag it. All right, cool. All right, stoked about the thing. Okay, we got like five left. We got like five left. Copy in there. All right, we got five left, y'all. Thank you so much for hanging out with me through this. One, two, three, four, five. We've got two UFCs, three UFCs. We've got an MLB for you baseball fans. I'm going to grab an NFL. Okay. Okay, so this one, this one I really need anything hot. I want an 8, 9, or a 10 on. This is a bow knuckle. I already know what this card is. This is a mark of greatness. This is slash 49. This is hand signed by Bo. 9. Take it. I'll take it. Again, it's hard to get. It's hard to get that auto. Um, to grade back as a 10. I would have loved a 10 on this card. Look how sexy that card is, man. My God. Bow nickel, y'all. So obviously, you know, I'm an Aaron fan. I'm a Tetsuro fan. I'm a Rossus Jr. fan. And I'm a bow nickel fan. Like, those are the, those are the rookies you want, you wanted last year. Um, so yeah, I'm stoked that I got an eye on that. Okay, Rachmanov time. This is a ten. Oh, this is a uh, gold. So this is a very. Uh, there's a, there were only ten of these. Oh, that's an eight. Disaster. It's not as a rookie card. So okay, I, I, you know that's alright. Ah, uh, yeah, that card's not going to be worth. Very much. Hey, but look. I'm not complaining, man. We, we did 52 cards. How many eights did we get? Four, five? 
and then the majority have been tens. I'd say like what, 70% tens and then the rest nines. I don't know, I have to go back and look. It's a sexy card though, he's a great fighter, but you know, an eight and eight blows balls there. Okay. Volkanowski. Now this is the acetate. This, so this is a mem patch. This is a slash eight. Um, and this is hand signed as well. Volk, I think, you know, he's he's gonna be a Hall of Fame fighter for sure. I think the price has dipped a little bit on Volkanowski just because of um his recent losses, right? But um oh oh my god, we got a 10. That's sick. And that's a sick patch too. Mostly the UFC. Oh, it's not hand signed. I'm sorry. Okay, it's not hand signed. It's sticker signed. Four of eight. Ten. Damn, I thought I thought the acetates were hand signed. I guess not. Huh. Okay. I got a Sean O'Malley one. Um, the same thing, and it's and signed but okay still though 10 10 on the volkster what should we do next should we do the mlb or the gym uh, let's just we'll, we'll do mlb next we got we we did i don't i don't know a lot about baseball i just thought this card was cool rookie card Ali uh Rauschman with the orioles this was eight out of 25 and this is a a um Relic was worn by the featured player. Um, and that comes back as a nine, which is dope. I just thought the patch was sick. Right, like you could see a little bit of his number there, three colored patch. I pulled this out of like a tops target box for like nothing. I'm, I don't even know what this card's worth. Obviously it's gonna be like, it's his rookie card. He's playing well, but time will tell. I just love that patch on it. That's why I got it graded. That's pretty sick though for a nine. And again, it's out of 25. Because a lot of the men patches you get at that price point, they're like, they're they're unnumbered. All right, and the last card you all uh, was a Jamar Gibbs. This was a slash five um, and we got, we got a nine on it. Okay, that's okay. That's a purple spectrum and that's one through five Jamar Gibbs. Again, I'm a big believer in that in the Lions. And that's it. That's 52 cards, y'all, and I think we killed it. I think we did good. I think we get some value. I think it's increased the value of most of the cards. Um, you know, that that Wimby cracked ice, um, the Aaron tens that we got. We got a few unfortunate eights, um, but, you know, hey, it is what it is. Thank you so much for hanging out with me. Um, had a blast. 